Okay, we will solve for x. 1 over 6 plus 1 over 9 equals 1 over x. So, first we have to get the LCD. So, yung LCD natin dito is 18x. Kasi si 18x ay ma-divide sa 6, ma-divide sa 9, at saka ma-divide sa x. So, therefore, yung LCD natin is 18x. Okay, so, si 18x, i-multiply natin sa uh, both members of the equation. So, kay 1 over 6, at saka kay 1 over 9, at kay 1 over x. So, i-multiply uh, natin yan kay 1, 6, si LCD, at saka... 18x, i-multiply din natin kay 1 over 9 at saka si LCD na 18x, i-multiply din natin kay 1 over x Okay? So, ngayon i-divide natin to si 18x divided by 6 that is uh, 3x Okay? Kasi times 1 na yan eh uh, 18x Divide by 6 is 3x times 1 is 3x. Okay? Dinilitso ko na lang. Plus, 18x divided by 9 times 1. Okay? Parang ganun. So, 18x divided by 9, that is 2x. Okay? Times 1 is 2x. Equals. Cancel na natin to si x. Okay? So, ang naiwan dito, 18. 18 times 1 is 18. Okay, ngayon, i-combine natin yung like terms, yung uh, si 3x at saka si 2x. Kasi it's the same yung kanilang coefficient or yung kanilang uh, literal coefficient. Therefore, similar yan sila. Kung similar, pwede sila i-combine. So, 3x plus, 5, uh, plus 2x is 5x equals 18. Okay? And then, i-apply natin yung uh, divis division property of equality. I-divide natin si 5x sa kanyang coefficient na, sa kanyang coefficient, okay? So, 5x equals 18, divide na sila both sides by 5. Okay? So, i-cancel natin. Ang naiwan dito is x equals 18 over 5. So, i-divide natin yan. 18 divided by 5, that is Hindi siya 4. Hindi siya pwede 4. So, dapat 3. So, 15. So, 3. So, 3 and 4. 3 and 3. 15. So, this is your final answer. Bye-bye. Okay, we will solve for m in 5 over 6 minus m over 4 equals 1 over 12. So, ang gagawin lang natin dito una, kunin natin yung LCD. Okay? So, dapat si LCD ma-divide sa 6, ma-divide sa 4, at saka ma-divide sa 12. So, yung LCD natin dito is 12. Kasi si 12 ma-divide siya sa 6, ma-divide siya sa 4, and of course, ma-divide siya sa 12. So, yung LCD natin is 12. So, si LCD, i-multiply natin sa both members of the equation. So, 12 na LCD, i-multiply natin dito sa ating 5 over 6. Kopihan natin yung minus sign. Then, LCD na naman. I-multiply natin siya kay M over 4. Then, equals. Si LCD na naman. I-multiply din natin siya kay 1 over 12. Okay? Ngayon, uh, i-multiply natin si 12 times 5. Uh, 12 times 5. So, so, 60. So, 5 times 12 is 60 over 6. Minus 12 12m over 4 So 3m na lang ito 12 divided by 4 Is Kasi dinilit so kay 12 divided by 4 is 3 Times m 3m Okay Equals Cancel si 12 Cancel si 12 So 1 na lang Okay So 60 divided by 6 is 10 Minus 3m Equals 1 and then, i-apply natin yung uh, subtraction property of equality. Si 10 minus 3m minus 10 equals 1 minus 10. Okay? So, cancel natin yan si positive 10 at saka si negative 10. Ang naiwan dito, si negative 3m. 
So, equals si 1 minus 10 is negative 9. And then, i-divide natin to by the coefficient of m. Dito tayo sa taas para makita. So, negative 3m equals negative 9. Divide natin siya by negative 3. Si negative 9, divide natin siya by negative 3. Cancel natin yan, si negative 3. Ang may 1 dito, m na lang. And then, negative 9, divide by negative 3, that is positive 3. Kasi, again, kapag mag-divide tayo ng like sign, the result is positive. So, therefore, the final answer is m is equal to positive 3. Mami. Okay, we will solve uh, x plus 2 divided by x minus 3 equals 7 over 2. So, kung gagawin lang natin dito, kunin natin yung LCD. Okay, so yung LCD natin dito is 2 times x minus 3. Or kahit pulit ka rin mo yan, x minus 3 times 2. Okay, then i-multiply natin siya sa ating uh, x plus 2 over x minus 2. So, at saka dito kay 7 over 2, i-multiply natin sa LCD. Okay, so yung LCD natin is 2 times x minus 3. Then, i-multiply kay x plus 2 over x minus 3 equals LCD na naman x minus 3 multiply kay 7 over 2. So, cancel natin to si x minus 3 at saka si x minus 3. Ang naiwan dito, 2 times x plus 2. Dito naman sa kabila, cancel natin si 2, cancel si 2. Ang naiwan, magta rin natin ha, 7 times x minus 3. Pwede yan, kahit magkabaliktad. Okay, ngayon, simplify natin, apply natin yung distributive property. Okay? So, i-distribute natin yan si 2 kay x. So, 2 times x is 2x. Then, 2 times 2, that is positive 4. Equals, 7 times x is 7x. Then, 7 times negative 3 is negative 21. Okay. Ngayon, ah, uh, Combining like terms tayo, pwede natin isya i-apply ng uh, subtraction property of equality. I-subtract po ni natin TC4, i-transpose natin sa, pwede rin i-transpose natin sa right side, pwede rin subtract Okay? So, subtract na lang muna natin. So, 2x plus 4 minus 4 equals 7x minus 21 minus 4. Tapat both sides. Okay? Cancel yan si positive 4 at saka si negative 4 kasi 0 na yan ang labas. So, 2x ang naiwan dyan equals 7x. So, combine natin to. The same sila, like, uh, the same sila negative. Therefore, ang result yan, negative 21 plus negative 4 is negative 25. So, dito tayo sa taas. Continue tayo. So, i-transpose natin to si uh, or pwede tayo mag uh, mag subtract or i-transpose na lang natin na para hindi tayo maano dyan. So, 2x, transpose natin si, si positive 7x to the left side, magiging negative 7x. Okay? So, equals negative 25. Kita pa ba? Yan. So, 2x minus 7x, that is negative 5x. Okay? So, equals negative 25. Then, we will divide both sides by negative 5. Yung coefficient of x. Okay? So, negative 25. So, divide natin siya by negative 5. Divide natin sa kabila ng negative 5. Okay? So, ang naiwan, cancel natin yan. Kasi, ang pag-divide natin yung negative 5 sa negative 5, ang result ay 1. So, ang naiwan dito, x na lang. So, negative 25 divided by negative 5 is positive 5. So, this is your final answer. Bye-bye.